here we are with Jay and Jimmy Uso, eight-time tag team champions, the record longest reign in WWE history, and now opposite each other at WrestleMania. Brother versus brother. Now, historically, we've seen this before. We've had Bret and Owen Hart. We've had the Hardys. But this is different, guys. I mean, this is the bloodline with a run and a story arc that has commanded so much attention now for so long with a buildup that is just unbelievable. And that's where I want to start, Jay. What has this buildup been like for you to experience? Man, it was, uh, let me start off by, uh, let me correcting you just a little bit. <laughs> yes. Nine times. Well, hold on, hold on, I got you. Nine times. Not both of us, though. Oh, that's right, only one has. Nine time tag team champ. But yeah, you said it, Oos. Uh, history making. Brothers versus brothers, Zeus, for the third time. But this time, Oos, what makes this right here special, Oos? Twin versus twin right here. Yeah. So it's hard to prepare for him because he know exactly what I'm thinking half the time. Half the time, he finished my sentences, Zeus. You know what I'm saying? Half the time, he don't even have to, I don't even have to tell him what I'm going to say. And, and he, he literally says what I'm about to say. So I don't know. How's it been it for you? It makes it I bet he doesn't know he's losing at WrestleMania. Ask him, do you know that? Yeah, you don't know that. But you bring up the fact that you know each other so well. I mean, obviously, you twins, but stylistically, um, you both have similar styles. You both have elite, similar athleticism. Your arsenal of moves are very similar as well. So what are we in store for when this happens in the ring because of all that? I'm going to be honest. You literally said it. we have the exact same arsenal. I mean, but man, just because we're twins, I don't mean we know everything about each other. Yeah, he's you know? right, because I'm going to step in front of him because I'm the older brother. There will be no same move. There is no same repertoire. There is no same arsenal come WrestleMania when I step in the ring with you. I'm about to flip everything. Twins, nah. Contrast, yes. Difference, yes. There'll be different moves pulled out from me that he ain't never seen me do. I might, it might be the same thing. I won't count him out. Because he learned from older brother. I mean, he learned from the best, how many right? Minutes, how many minutes was it? How many minutes is it? Nine. Nine minutes of That's older brother. That's nine whole um, years. But he acts like it's nine get, years. We Zeus. did get a glimpse of this at the Royal Rumble. You were the first two entrants into the Royal Rumble. The face-off was so intense before you guys started going at it. What do you remember about that moment, Jay? I remember he told me he loved me. I said, I loved you, too. And then he hit me right in the face. And then I smacked that ugly grin off his face. Yeah. That's what I did. Yeah. I remember that, too. Your entire family is wrestling royalty. They're embedded in the business. It's a central story to what we're dealing with here in Philadelphia this weekend. What kind of reaction have you received from family members to watch the two of you go through this buildup? Why am I jealous? You are. Do you believe that? Yeah, 100%. Are you? Hell no. Of what? Him? Why would yes. he be? Why would I be? Well, he's receiving a ton of shine. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Th that's because of who? Movement is who helps my you shine? My merch is off the roof here, Ooze. Who helps you? Sh here we go. Do you believe he's jealous? Man, Jealous Jimmy is what I'm going to call him. Jealous Jimmy. Jealous Jim. <laughs> big Jealous Jim. Jealous you know, Big Jim. I see it. Did you see the whole yeet movement coming? I saw Did it. it grow organically, and has it shocked you? Man, you, or, you know what it was? It did, because I, I was very, I was, I was surprised how, you know, everybody caught Ask him where the first yeet came from. Where the first yeet come from? He's going to say it's him. Yeah, of course. Because it I was mean, me. So tell us, where did it come from? From this right hand when I whack and I said yeet. About five years old, maybe four or five, four or five. It's on video. Speaking of what's on video from your childhoods, this past week, everybody got to experience your origin story because of the documentary that was done on Roman Reigns. It got huge play, a lot of buzz, great home Shouts videos. Shouts out to the tribal chief. That's right. Great home videos, wonderful photos, great stories were told. 
of the two of you as kids. When you get to a point like this and this week and you're going up against each other, do you reflect on that? Do you think about the origin story at all? The brawls in the backyard, the fighting over Legos? That's when no we were orange. kids. That's, that's when we were kids, though. Sure. We grown men about to go out there and handle business now, Oost. And nothing's going to change, Ain't dog. no more swimming pools. Ain't no more backyard wrestling. You're right. Yeah, it's no a more. whole ring out there. I'm about to go out there and kick you, kick your teeth right down your mouth in front of our whole family. You better kick all 32 teeth down, Oost, because I'm telling you, come XL Saturday, our family, then you know what time it is. You know the vibe with how it's been since these last three months has been hell. Our family has been going through things because the Usos, the twins, they're never like this. Us, we it's teach your our, fault. We teach our kids not to fight family. That's right. We literally about to go out there and fight each other, bro. Did you guys talk about this as kids? When you were even teenagers or up and coming and, and um, you know, crafting your skill in the business, did you ever say to yourself, you know, someday this kind of a moment will happen? I mean, come on, man. We're kids dreaming. We dream big. The Owen Hart and Bret Hart had the same dream, I bet. The Hardy Boys had the same dream, I bet. Every brother that comes in here, I'm sure it runs in their mind one time or another. I would love to go head to head with my brother. But the animosity between all this buildup, I wasn't ready for it. All those emotions that's happening in this game right now, I wasn't ready for it. It's a different vibe when it comes from twins. It's a different vibe. Everybody want a twin until they have one. Y'all don't know what it's like to see the same face every day. To put on, your thoughts is the same, you spoke, you speak the same, you look the same, you get, you get confused. Yeah, it's all cool until, until that. I look a little better though. I'm gonna give each of you a but final come opportunity. Saturday, you ain't gonna look nowhere as good as you do now, yeah, because we'll I'm gonna kick all your teeth yeah, in. We gonna see. Eyes swole, nose broke, lip bleeding, come on. We'll see. Your final chance to look your brother in the face and make a statement before you meet each other in front of the world. Hey, I'm going to tell you this. Oops. Whatever happens out there in that ring stays in that ring. Whatever happens. If you down to, to, to level back up with me and, and just be tight, we can go out there and hash it out in front of the whole world. But I promise you, I will leave mine in the ring. I'm always going to love you. I'm going to owe you my twin brother, all right? Whatever happens after this, bro, I'm always going to love you. I would like to just, after the one, after, after the one, two, three, whether it be me or you, bro. Man, we could be the Usos again. That's me. That's me, though. Can't do it running around with this bloodline, though. Guys, we can't wait to see it. Thanks for spending time. Great to be with you. Thank you, Oz.